white to play and win. The first few moves are pretty easy. Exchange queens. Now we want to get the bishop on f6. So we distract the rook. It has to look after the b-pawn. Bishop f6 threatens rook h8 mate. Black plays g5 to give the king some room. Now you've got to get it right. This is tricky. First of all, pawn takes pawn. Rook h8 and rook h6 is threatened. That's mate. And after bishop f3, you've got to get the right king move. King h3 is correct. And here's why. Bishop takes pawn. Looks like the black king is going to escape again. But here we distract the rook again. It's got to take. Now the g-pawn is free to move. And that covers the f5 square. And now the mating net is set. There's no decent defense to rook h8 and rook h6 checkmate.